Hi everybody, I am here again. So in this video I will show you something more about the project that I we will create in this video series. So we will create a notes application that allows you to create a note and uh, put a title and put the text that will be inside the note. So we will have a home page where you can show the the notes we can create notes we can delete notes we can edit notes our application will be created in three different languages in English in Portuguese and in Spanish and at the end of the course now that we are developing the course I will create this the this app using an SPA that is single page application is just a static web page that you can put in a web server and in the future when the application is done we will build this application for PWA the progressive web apps that will allow us to install our application in any uh, operating system that runs uh, Chrome and I think Edge also supports uh, PWA and uh, we can also install in Android uh, phones. I don't know if iPhone support, but I think it, they, they support the Proxy Web Apps. And we will also compile this application for Electro that allows us to run our code as a native, no, it's not a native application, but we can install our application in Windows, Linux, and Mac OS and I will also compile this application for Android and I will show you how to publish it on Google Play Store and what we will use to to create our app so we will use the Vue.js that is a UI framework that is a very uh, famous framework to create your user interface and we will also use the Quasar. Quasar is a, is a type of library of components that is already done so we doesn't need to create our components and the Quasar is created using the material design so we can create very beautiful and we have a lot of components as you can see here in this website, the documentation, we have buttons, cards, um, dialogues, uh, form components, we have menus, a lot of things. And Quasar is not only this library of components, but is also a type of stack. They have a client for, for console where we can create, where we can build uh, using Quasar we can also easily use the same folder, the same project to compile to these to these uh, environments that are Progressive Web Apps, single application as you can see here in the documentation there is a place here I think Quasar clear yeah we can develop for a lot of platforms using Quasar. We doesn't need to configure everything a lot of times because Quasar has a configuration file and it is this configuration file for different platforms so Quasar is very useful and they have a lot of plugins and things that help us to develop an application very very easy. So I think it is a very useful uh, platform. Come back in here, we will also use the Dexy.js. Dexy.js is a framework for to that help us to use the indexed DB um, database that is a database that is um, that is already in every browser. So it is a local database we will not use a server to store um, 
this database we will not use MySQL or any other, other type of server database so we can use these applications offline so this is very awesome very 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 interesting too uh, and we also use the view internationalization uh, plugin that allow us to create a application in different languages and for this course we will need some tools we will need the uh, node.js installed in your computer you need the quasar clear and when we will build this application for progressive apps for electron for android we we will need another things for example for android we will need the android sdk but when we compile when we will build this application for these platforms i will show you how to install everything that you need in your computer to build this application but for these other things that you need to you need to install in your computer i will leave links in the video description because this videos was already re recorded by another person uh, they are available in a page that has more details that i can cover on a video so you can include you you can go to the node.js page you can go to the quasar and they show you how to install then in in your computer so i will leave the links in the description so you can install so my, in this video is just this in the next video we will start to create the the application and i will see you in the next videos thank you so much for for watching bye bye